Now let's get the latest forecast on Hurricane Harvey. Meteorologist Megan Glaros of our Chicago station WBBM TV is here with that. Megan, good morning. Yes, good morning to you, Anthony. We do have the absolute latest for you now. The system continues to weaken in terms of its wind speed, but not at all in terms of what it's going to pump in here moisture wise, still tapping in to the Gulf of Mexico, still a category one storm, but now the winds on this are down to 80 miles per hour and wind speeds at 80. The forward motion still around the same at about six miles per hour, still just crawling and that will not change over the course of the next few days. We already have some high rainfall totals courtesy of Harvey. Let's take a peek at what's already on the map. Victoria already over 16 inches of rain. McFadden over 11, almost 12 inches of rain. We're at almost 11 and a half inches in Ostwell. Edna nine inches, Sugarland nine inches, and it has only just begun. We're talking about days of rainfall to come. Let's take a look at what we're going to deal with here in terms of additional rainfall coming in with this because again, remember, Remember, even if it moves back out over the Gulf and restrengthens, we're still pulling in that moisture. If it stays over the state of Texas, still pulling in that moisture. We're looking at rainfall totals that could include in this white shaded area here upwards of three feet of rain, perhaps as much as 40 inches of rainfall. And I want to show you the National Hurricane Center track because if you've ever looked at a hurricane before and you look at the track, what we often see is a cone and we call it the cone of error. This time around, it does this. And so the cone is more like a circle. It's just going to sit and meander over portions of Texas, tapping into an unlimited source of moisture. We're talking about days on end of rain here. And again, rainfall totals that could top 40 inches in spots. Dana. Meteorologist Megan Glaros of our Chicago station, WBBM. Thank you, Megan.